Samantha here and welcome back to another installment of Mobile Mondays and today we will be uh, looking at the Final Fantasy 15 Pocket Edition. Yes, you heard me properly. Final Fantasy, which is my ultimate favorite game of all times. I'm just going to say game franchise Square Enix. I love that company as a mo as a as a video game company and the fact that they took one of my favorite games Final Fantasy and made a pocket edition of it and it just so happens to be 15 which is I'm currently working on right now and I absolutely love the story and love the characters and they made a pocket edition. And I'm just like mind doggone blown. But anyway, my brother told me about this this weekend and I was like, what? So I had to play it today and check it out and see what it's all about. So it says the tale of the chosen king, savior to the star. Let's tap to start. And oof, I'm like, I got chills, y'all. I got chills. You, you have no idea how much I love Final Fantasy. Noctis K Callum. I never knew how to pronounce that. But y'all, so basically it's going to be the exact same story as Final Fantasy. So if you haven't played the the video game console, knocked. Hang in there, buddy. Okay, let's cut this up some. We'll keep him busy. Oh my gosh, y'all. This is like the same exact, sorry for the volume. Okay. Okay, okay. Um, all right, so... Oh my gosh, y'all, this is the exact story. So this is exactly how the game begins. The characters are just drawn a little bit differently. They've been created. The kingdom of Lucius and the empire of Nephilim are trying to bring the long war between their two states to an end. The prince of Lucius, Noctis, wants to negotiate a ceasefire and has set out from the kingdom with his friends. As proof of peace, the prince has been betrothed to Luna Freya of Tenenbrai. All right. Oh, I finished that right in time. <laughs> I'm glad I'm remembering like how to pronounce some of these things because it's been a while since I played the game, but um, it's still like on my the list. Creed hour is come. Set forth with my blessing, Prince Noctis. Thank you, Your Majesty. Take your leave and go in the grace of the gods. Right. Wow. The fact that they recreated this entire game and they made different characters, my mind is blown right now. I'm not hugely impressed by the way the characters are drawn, but it's, you know, for a mobile version. Well, princes will be princes. So okay. much for royal protocol. Not like you had to deliver a formal address. Your oh my gosh, look at his gladiolus. <laughs> What now? Oh my gosh, y'all. This is beautiful. I'm loving this. I fear I have left too much unsaid. You place a great burden on those who would bear with you. <laughs> You're one to talk. I ask not that you guide my wayward son. Merely that you remain at his side. Indeed, Your Grace. We'll see the prince to Altissia if it's the last thing we see. Yeah, what he said. Hate to break this up, but of course got the motor running. Drados, he's in your hands. And another thing. Do mind your manners around your charming bride to be. Aww. <laughs> your majesty as well. Try to mind yours around our esteemed guests from Niflheim. You have no cause for concern. Nor do you. Wow. Take heed. Once you set forth, you cannot turn back. You think I would? Regis is, I mean, I not Regis, not this is so stubborn. ready to leave home behind. Don't know about you, but... I'm ready as I'll ever be. Take care on the long road. Wheresoever you should go, the line of Lucis goes with you. Sorry, y'all. I had to make that silent so I wouldn't interrupt with that. I apologize for that. <gasps> it's exactly like the console game. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. Y'all. Like, I need something else to, to deter me from other things. Like, I need something else. Y'all, oh my gosh. This is the entire game. The storyline so far is exactly like the console. And y'all, bonus, it's free in the App Store. 
Yeah, you heard me properly. It's free. I don't know if there's going to be some in-app purchases, but as of right now, I saw free and I just hit the get button and I just got it. I am so impressed right now. I'm, I'm not I'm not really digging the characters, but that's because I know what they look like in real life. Not in real life, but in the game. Like I know how they look like on the console edition. So it's kind of throwing me for a loop, like looking at them like this. But, you know, they've been kind of, I guess, decide. I don't even know what you call. OK, yes, we're going to. Yes, let's do that. Um, so we're going to download this real quick and I'll be right back. All right, guys, the update is done. It took quite a little bit. There was actually a handful of updates back to back to back. So it's a sizable game. If you down decide to download it, you're probably going to want to make sure you have like a lot of space. And I'm assuming as you progress through the game, maybe more stuff will download because I just can't imagine it downloaded the entire game, you know, in that little bit. Oh, my goodness, though. This is the game, y'all. Wow. Hmm. Yeah, you can only go so far on the kindness of strangers. You're just gonna have to push her all the way. I've already pushed myself. <laughs> to the brink of death. Exactly. You'll get up. <sighs> Come on, the car isn't gonna move itself. Jeez. I thought the car was supposed to move us. Wouldn't that be nice? Can it? Ready, steady. Push! Okay, so are you going to give me the controls? Okay, tap to hold, tap and hold to push the car. You will start to push the car forward when the gauge is full. Okay, so tap to hold. All right, so let's tap. All right, so we're going to hold it. Or can I let it go? Oh, no, you have to continue holding it. All right, no biggie. This is easy, easy so far. What? Push this thing by yourself. All by myself. <laughs> you won't even notice if we just let go. Pronto, don't even think about it. <laughs> I love the characters in this game, y'all. They all have their own little personalities and they nah, we just switch back there. And it's my turn, not his turn. <sighs> the world's a big old place filled with wonders. Uh, tell that to my legs. Yeah, they all have their own little personality, so it's so fun just to like, <laughs> you know, like you know what to expect from them regarding certain situations. Like Gladiolus is the brute, you know, he's kind of like the strong guy and kind of like the, the oh, and here she go. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's Cindy. Oh my goodness, they did her good on here. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is so funny. Hitch just yet. Lady Luna Freya's groom to be here in Hammerhead. Apologies for taking so long. <laughs> you best save your apologies for Papa. Well, that makes you. Sandy. Sid's grease monkey granddaughter. Roll her in while I'm still young. And there goes Sid. Didn't your daddy tell you? She's a custom classic, not some beat up old clunker. Oh my gosh. Not this. Uh, yeah. Prince. Like they took your old man and kicked the dignity out of me. <laughs> you had a long way to go, son. Oh my gosh. And that slack jaw is getting you nowhere fast. But yeah. It'll take a while. you will get her in and run along. Okay. He didn't even look at it good. He just knew. He just knew it was gonna take a little bit. Y'all heard him. Let's get moving. Right this way. Oh my gosh, y'all! I'm like so excited right now. I gotta have so many mobile games I'm playing right now, though. I swear. Uh, never liked that game. Never any good at it either. Look at the graphics, though. Oh, the graphics are beautiful. The extra time. All right, tap the floor to move the character. Begin exploring. All right, so we tap the floor. All right, tap. All right. Okay, easy enough. Tap the main menu button to see the map, quest points, character status, ascension, exploration items. Oh my god, so it's going to be like the full game. This is the full game, y'all. Whoa, they got Ebony out here. Oh, Ignis is going to flip. Wait, 
Oh, uh, what's a gill? That's the amount of money. That's I money. Feeling our money's no good here, Noct. Yeah, that's money. Bet you Ignis came prepared, though. Let's ask him. Yeah, Ignis is the the very um, mannerable. He's like the upstanding. I don't even know what to call him, but he's like <laughs> the posh one out the group. He like wants everything to be like neat, and he cooks and and um, yeah. So that's Ignis. So we need to talk to Ignis and Prompto, which is the guy right here that he was just talking to. He's our little photographer, and of course Noctis is the um, the actual. Oh, so you can zoom in and zoom out. Okay, and this is the map that we've unlocked so far. So click to close the map. All right. And then we need to go find. Okay. So you can't just drag your finger on the screen as opposed to just touching the screen. And this is pretty much how you walk around. If we need to talk to somebody, we just click that little three button thing. It seems like so we can go over here. All right, cool. So we need to see if we have some gill. I probably overlooked him because I'm so busy running around. So here's gladiolus right here, or they call him Gladdy for short. And did I completely miss Ignis y'all? I feel like I did. So you got to kind of know what the characters look like <laughs> so you can know to look for them. But I think I'm, I'm playing right now on my iPhone X and I'm wondering if it'll look a lot better. Oh, there he is over there. Okay. I wondered if it'll look at see that big old exclamation point on there, but I'm wondering if it'll be easier to play on the Enough iPad. Room and board. So okay. The matter? Got any change on you? The local kind. Funny you should ask. I just paid. So change is about all we have left. Okay. Gladio's got the last of it. Alrighty. You might share if you ask nicely. Sure, sure deal. And then sometimes they also give you um so let's ask Glad. Well, see you around. Thanks. Stay beautiful. Oh, I will. Hey, you got any <laughs> money on you? Not anymore. Information doesn't come cheap around here. Alright. Try Iggy. He's got the last of it. I just talked to Ignis. Okay, so Iggy is Ignis. Like they all got nick nicknames. So I just talked with Ignis. So um let's see what that is. Taka's pit stop. Our spicy jambalaya jambalaya <laughs> have you jumping for joy and scampering for seconds. Give it a taste. Okay. Yeah, because you have to eat and stuff in this game too. Well, you don't have to, but if you eat and flat broke. All right. Adding insult to injury. Yeah, I'm going over here to talk to Sydney. Sid Sin Cindy. Oh my goodness. I used to do that in the game when I played the game too, y'all. Okay. All right. Okay, y'all. They're just going on. They're just complaining. How do we make money? Um. So then you can ask. You could actually tailor make your your experience, which is the same way as a console game. You can ask for discount. We could ask for a loan, or we could ask my friends. So let's ask for a loan. So she gave us a hundred gil. Must be what Papa meant when he said he was gonna teach them boys a lesson. Uh oh. Told me he ought to have y'all take care of some. Some what? Oh, okay. Causing a ruckus around here. So you gotta continuously click I'd the be screen. Happy to pay y'all for your services if you're up to the challenge. How about it? Of course. So much for finding an easy way out. Thanks a lot, Papa. <laughs> All right, so we finished the quest. We got some experience yeah. points. Oh my gosh, y'all, this is exactly, if you close the app during autosave, there's a chance to save data become, we are not going to do that. All right, so we need to eliminate three pests, so we already know what we got to do. Since I've played this already before on the console, we got to cross the street over here, and then go, oh, there goes some right there, so there goes some pests. Approach items on the field map to pick them up. Break wooden boxes or kick mounds of sand, and you may find something. All right, so, um, kick mounds of sand, can I kick, oh, Wow. How did they do this, y'all? I'm like, the game itself is like so detailed and stuff. So I'm like, the fact that they dumbed it down. I'm not going to say dumbed it down, but they made us a, a smaller version for mobile. Okay, so where's my... Okay, there we go. So I'm just tapping this guy over and over. All right. If I hold it down, will it do anything? Because normally you can warp. I guess we can't warp in here. Maybe he hasn't unlocked it yet. Okay, how do we do? All right, so we got some... All right, it's a little bit different than... Okay, so we got one set of pests, but it said you could kick mounds. So let me see, where would a mound be? I'm looking to see if I see anything. Because that's a little different from the game. Oh, goodness. And he complains a lot, y'all. He complains a lot. All right, so we got a fossil shell. And then this is a mound right here. We could probably kick that. We got a potion, which is what helps our health. Uh, so the only thing is I wish I could tilt the screen just to kind of see what's ahead of us. But that's okay. We're going to walk over here and grab the giant fat. Oh, here goes some more people right here. All right, let's go. Hey, get out of here. 
I wonder if I just hold it down. Oh, I can't just hold it down. Okay. Sorry for the notifications, y'all. Okay. I could just hold it down. I put on do not disturb, but it is just not working for me today. I have to figure out a way to cut stuff off when I'm recording. Okay. And then go here. So I'm just tapping the screen, but I'm thinking you could probably hold it down too. Okay, good. Piece of cake. Of course. Y'all, this one is so cool. It's actually kind of easier to play it like this. We still got some more. We got oh, whoa. Oh, yeah, I remember that. I love this game so much, y'all. Oh, my God. I am, like, cheesing right now. If y'all can see my face. Oh, here's a box. Click that box. Okay. Got a potion. And then go. let's go click this box right here. Oh, we got more boxes over there, y'all. Let's go grab all of this stuff. Y'all, I am, like, so excited about this. The thing is with the game, though, I think I'm, like, 70... I think I'm like 70 hours into the console game, but y'all, I took my time. Like when I say I did a whole bunch of side missions, I'm curious if they're going to have like side missions and stuff with this too, or is it just going to be main? Okay. This is a guy we got to fight. Okay. I didn't know that. I didn't know who that was. He was just bouncing around. Like this is not in the game. Okay. Whoa. I'm concentrating y'all. I'm concentrating. We tapping the heck out of this dude. Get back in here. There we go, Gladiolus. Thank you. Sometimes you can switch characters too, but it's not giving me... Okay, so we got a Cactar Needle. Yeah, that's different. I haven't... I didn't have that option before. Okay, here goes some more guys. I didn't have that before, so that's different. Um, Alright, so here we go. Yeah, and I'm, I'm used to warping, and like they're not giving me the option to warp. And then sometimes if you do... Um, oh, wait. Oh, what was that? Y'all, I was so busy clicking that I missed it. Darn it. I don't know what that was. Okay. Oh, war okay. Oh, that's parry. That's parry. Okay, that's a parry attack. Okay. So you can block in, but... Okay, parry, parry, parry. Okay, there we go. You need two hands for this. So honestly, it might be easier to play on your phone or a smaller device. That way you can have both hands ready so you can click that. Did I do it? I didn't do it that time. See, I, I was trying to do it with the one hand and it doesn't work. You have to do it with both hands. Okay, there we go. You have to do it with both hands. There we go. Okay, I don't know what that is, but... Oh, it's a warp. It looks like warp, but it's not like what I'm used to. Yeah, I rule. Yeah, I rule. Oh. I don't know if I did it that time successfully. Because the only problem is, is all I'm clicking, I can't really see what's going on. I'll be able to see it once I play it, once I edit the feed, the, um, the playback. All right. Okay, cool. Yeah, so there's some subtle differences to the real game. But of course, I know it's not going to be exactly like the real game, but... I think it's a really nice alternative to those who want to play and maybe don't have the console. And um, excited for the next time our car breaks down. No. Really that <laughs> yep, he likes Cindy. Really <laughs> he likes Cindy. Let's go grab these boxes real quick. All right. Okay, go over here. It's kind of give. Oh, I can't go down. Oh, I gotta go down this way, maybe. Can I jump? Okay, can really? Cause that's a. I think I got a pebble in my shoe. That looks like Check a box we'd be able to get. Yeah. They do this all the time in the console game, y'all. They just talk and complain. Like, you just run around and they'll just, like, talk to each other and complain and stuff. And, you know, <laughs> they'll have, like, whole conversations and stuff. Uh, okay, so we're just grabbing all this. this in. I feel like we should go around here and see what's in this building. Like, in the game, in the console game, there is something in that building. But it feels like... Oh, wait. Can I can I get these? I can't get these. Okay. Um, Sick of walking around. Oh, goodness. I'm telling y'all, he doesn't complain. Yeah. All he does is complain, 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 complain. I wonder if it's going to be a hundred percent open world. Like this just goes on forever. Well, that's what I was wondering. Yeah. Don't see the point in running. The exercise will do you good. Well, technically we're done with the missions. I guess we can go back. Can you quick travel? Let's see. Can we quick travel back or no? Eliminate. Oh, we didn't even finish eliminating all the pests. I could have swore we got them all. Oh yeah, we didn't even finish getting all the pests. Okay, uh, let's see what the rest of this map says. So we got the map, we got our equipment list, and you can toggle through the different... Oh my god, the music, y'all. Put your headphones on and just go to town. Do y'all hear this? That's one thing I love about Final Fantasy 2 is the soundtrack is always is always on point. Okay, so there we got our bag where we have all of our... Phoenix is if you die, that's how you completely recover. Ether is the poison one. Right? Or no, no, the MP, I'm sorry. Uh, potion, of course, is to get your HP back up. And, uh, all right. And then we can sync. We got music, subtitles, all that good stuff. Graphics. We got high resolution. Can you make it any higher? Highest quality mode. Oh. 
30 frames per second. We could probably do maximum frames per second because I got this nice iPhone X. Let's see if it makes a difference. It, it, I don't really see a difference, but maybe once I edit the video, I'll see. But normally my video quality gets 60 frames when I'm recording from this phone. Yeah, no, it's, it's being choppy now. So probably wouldn't recommend maximum, but I'll do 30 because that's what they say. But I'll keep it on high quality mode and see if that does anything. Yes? No? Maybe so? No, yeah, no, y'all. Yeah. Okay, so don't put it on highest quality mode. Put it on high. <laughs> All right, I think that's good. Yeah, it was super choppy. Okay. Oh, whoa, that's crazy. Okay, here goes some more people right here. Let's go get these guys real quick. Oh, there's somebody up here. Nah, we got this, player. We are Noctis and crew. Gladios with that big old sword. All right, so let's get long tap a far away foe or the... Okay. Oh, here we go to warp strike. Okay, good. So long type and then we're gonna Okay. Okay. Hold the icon of enemy enemies off the screen to warp strike them. Okay. Warp drag during wait, blah, drag during battle to warp in that direction. Okay. Okay, so drag and then go over. Y'all, this not it's not doing what I wanted to do. Okay. Okay, did it do it? I can't tell if it did it or not. Okay, you know what? Let's just eliminate these guys real quick and then I'll that's confusing because at least on the console you got different buttons for it instead of just holding down. So you have to have a, I guess like a long press option for your phone to rec. Okay, well somehow we were able to get it, but I didn't. I don't think I successfully were able to do the warp strike. So my life flashed before my eyes. Thanks. You're welcome. All right, so quest complete. Now we can go back to Cindy. Nice. Mission complete. There's little subtle differences about it. Okay, so then we got our level up. We got an AP, which is an ascension point. We can apply that for different little, you know, it's, it's a learning curve with Final Fantasies. There's like a lot of stuff to do where you can level up your characters and stuff like that. So um, it's just going to take some getting used to like playing it to understand if you've never played it before. But um, I am like so pleasantly surprised that this is so similar to the console game. And so, and I'm going to link actually after the video, I'll link all of my um, Final Fantasy videos. I stopped playing it because I wasn't getting like a, I was playing it for myself, but I stopped playing it for the, the channel because I wasn't getting like a ton of views off of it. And it was stressing me out how much it, like you want to play the game and have fun. Today. Yep. Getting pretty dark out here. Yeah, it's getting dark. Yep, we'll that's that right, right there. I remember that from the game. But yeah, it was it was stressing me out because I wanted I love Final Fantasy so much. I wanted to just play the game and not have to worry about playing it, stopping, editing it, uploading it, playing it, stopping, editing, uploading. <laughs> and that's what my my mentality had got to be. And then I wasn't getting that many views. So I kind of just had to take a step back and say, you know what? I'm playing it for myself. I was trying to share it with you guys, of course. But if nobody's interested, I'll just play it for myself. So I'm playing it by myself now. But of course. I'm not doing it for the channel anymore, but I have a couple of videos so you guys could kind of compare if you want to see the console version versus the mobile version and you can see like side by side um, the difference. So the ascension points, which is what I was just talking about, you receive in your journey can be used to strengthen your character's techniques. Yep. So let's go to the exploration page. So we can go to ascension and then this is where you can kind of like unlock certain methods or whatever. So they want us to go on and unlock Noctis's parry, which I thought is what I was doing earlier, but apparently I wasn't. But parry is basically when a... Uh, an, an, uh, an enemy attacks you, you can immediately go back. <laughs> you can immediately go back and attack them back. Like you, you block them from attacking you and then you return with an attack. So that's really nice. Um, so then we have a counter attack. We could either do this one or this one, but they're make, they're not letting us do it because those, I guess, are not available. So anyway, Hunter becomes a hunted, head to the abandoned shack. So what did Cindy say? He needs us to find some Dave guy. He went missing. Not missing. He said he's holed up in that shack. Is it a shack over here? I think it's the shack over here. I like this whole block thingy because normally you just run across items in the world and you just pick them up. So just running running across blocks is kind of cool. That's that's definitely different from the game. But the storyline and everything so far um, is very similar. Have a look, knocked. All right, let's go in here. 
But if you guys are going to enjoy this, I'll play it some hey, more. How's it look over there? What's this? All right. Mutant dual horn sighting. All right. And that's basically what we're going to have to fight. Head to the banished shack. Okay. So let's get this. So I think he was hunting. If I remember the story correctly, he was hunting that down and then it ended up. I can murder some fine dining. There he go. I'm telling y'all he complains. <laughs> he always wants to eat and sleep. Yep. Okay. We were getting attacked. If you need to heal your character in the middle of battle, you can use items from your backpack. All right. And then we can just, okay. So we need to get the potion. All right. So tap to resume the, okay. So good. Okay. So let's go. I might have to figure out this warp thingy. Okay. Oh, there we go. There we go. All right. But you have to watch his MP when you do that whole thing because it takes a, oh, it takes up a lot of MP for him to do that. So, and right now he's just starting out. So I'm not going to play around with it too, too much. Okay. So it's just a matter of tapping when you need to tap. And you got the other NPCs. They play along with you. Hopefully we'll get to a point where we get to control them. Because you used to be able to do their attacks with them. Like you could switch them out and do the attacks together. But I don't know if they'll be able to give us that option. Oh. There we go. Okay. I don't know if we... And then the one good thing too about the piece, the console version is they give you a report card. They actually grade you. They'll actually give you like an A, C, or D, or F. <laughs> Which is annoying. Because it used to be like... I don't know. I don't know if they took care of Dave. Uh, but I want to go over here, but it seems like it's blocking me from going certain places. Yeah, it's not 100% open world because I can't even go beyond here. But there's a box over there and there's a cactar over there. Let's grab this, though. Late, lead him. Oh, he's going to have a recipe. Up, <laughs> I've come up with a new recipe. <laughs> can't wait to try it. So he cooks for them and the recipes actually give you a boost in battle, but they only last for a certain amount of time. So some of them will give you like an HP boost. Some of them will give you a strength boost. So normally when they go to sleep and he cooks, you can decide based on what your next battles are going to be, what type of meal you want to have. So that's like his, um, yeah. So basically that's what it's when you pick up, you got to pick up. <laughs> And so many things you got to do y'all in this game. So it's a lot of stuff that goes into this game because then you have to find the ingredients in order for him to make stuff or you could buy stuff, which means you need to get gill in order to get gill. You have to like come across items in the world and sell them or you have to do missions for people and get money because they're going to be stranded. Well, I don't want to give you guys spoilers, but they are stranded for a little bit. And um, so you have to do spoilers. I mean, not spoilers. I <laughs> know you don't have to do spoilers. You have to do. Um, all right. So let's get these guys. Oh, whoa. He already. Oh, that's how you parry. Okay. I got it. So you just swipe the screen. Okay. But I want to fight somebody now. I don't want to do that no more. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I don't want to do that anymore. All right. Then let's go this way. Oh, my gosh. I like this. I got to pay attention to their, their HP levels too, y'all. Okay. I'm in stasis right now. So I can't do that anymore. Stasis basically means that his MP is low and I can't. I mean, MP is like magic points. Okay. There we go. There we go. All right. Good, good, good. Let's go over here and get. Oh, whoa. Thank you. Oh, okay. There we go. Wow. All right. Hopefully I'm doing good. Like I said, I can't. That's the only problem. I'm like, I can't really tell. You've grown stronger. Thank you, Gladiolus. That, that means a lot coming from him. That, that, comes, that, that means a lot coming from him. The man of the hour. Hi, Dave. And didn't mean to cause you all any trouble. I've been stuck here on account of my sprained ankle. Yeah, something funny about them varmints. I gave them hell, but couldn't finish the job. Still one mean mud about. Well, y'all don't look much like hunters, but what do you say? Put that puppy to rest for me? Yeah, no problem. Um, We could do it for free, or we could do it for a price, or we could ask them. Let's ask my friends. All right. Oh, sounds too dangerous to be let alone. Tell us where to go. So Ignis, of course, wants to do the proper thing. Y'all got guts, that's for sure. Let me tell you where I last saw them. I've been hunting for years, but I ain't never seen dual horns with blood red tusks like those. Wonder if the night's growing longer's got anything to do with them showing up. <laughs> Whatever it is, we ought to take it out before it can spawn any more like it. Yeah, at nighttime, it does get pretty bad here. All right, so we got that. So I think what I'm going to do, though, y'all, because um, we got to take out down the Bloodhorn. I'm going to go on and end. I got that. Okay, good. I want to get that. 
Okay. So we could ask for cash, but I asked our friends and Ignis was just like, just show us in that direction. Of course, he wanted to do the right thing as opposed to, um, you know, asking for cash. But we kind of needed the cash, but that's okay. Um, we need the gill. I, I doubt he needs actual cash because he's a prince, but okay, there's stuff in here. Tonight, but anyway. What are we thinking? Uh, something edible, I guess. <laughs> really? All right, let's get that. Yes. There's something else over here. Can I rotate the screen? I cannot rotate the screen, but there was something else up here, it looks like. Okay. Maybe not. Yeah, there is something else over here. How can I get over there and see? I can't get beyond there. Oh, there we go. Okay. All right, good. Giant feather. All right, too bad I can't rotate the screen because I kind of want to get a view of where stuff is at. And you can't really jump. Yeah, you can't really jump right there. Can I drop down? No, I can't drop down. So I have to go back in here. But anyway. Sometimes I wonder if we'll ever sit inside that beautiful car again. <laughs> oh my goodness. Sitting most of the day was pretty nice. Was even better. Oh my gosh, they are so crazy. I'm telling y'all, they do this the entire game. We just walk around and talk. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this first impressions look at Final Fantasy Pocket Edition. Hopefully you guys enjoy. If you like this though, let me know because I'm going to play it regardless. And if you guys want to see more of it, I can definitely play some more for the channel. I just want to make this video very long. And of course, I'm getting all sorts of notifications right now so um we're gonna go on and wrap it up hopefully you guys enjoyed let me know stick down in the comment box down below let me know if you're gonna get this game um i i know clash of clans right now people want me to do more videos on that and i do too because i got a lot accomplished last week so i'll probably be figuring out a way to just do a regular scheduled video for it so give me some time to figure that out and in the meanwhile hopefully you guys have a great rest of your day and i'll see you guys next time bye